everyone what's up welcome back to my youtube channel right now i'm just at the gas station i actually need to fill up with gas and then i'll catch up with you guys on everything that's going on also it's so hot <laughs> So it is way too hot, but now I feel naked. I'm not one to talk about the weather, but since when is it 95 degrees in January? That just doesn't make sense to me. So right now I'm actually just on my break from work and I thought I'd pull out my camera because I have some fun things to do today and I just want to take you guys along. First thing, Alex got another new puppy. So I'm going to take you guys to meet him with me. His name's Boba. I named Vader and then Boba Alex came up with. So they're two little French bulldogs and they are so cute. I've met them both, but I haven't, like we haven't brought Boba back cause he just turned like eight weeks or whatever it is. So yeah, I'm so excited to meet my new little puppy and I'm there every day. So it's basically mine. And I don't know how small he's gonna be. Cause last time I saw him, he was I think six weeks. Yeah, so we're just gonna talk about what's to come in this vlog. So meeting my cute puppy, super cute, super fun. Gonna be so exciting. And also Sophia, one of my best friends starts rush tomorrow so i wanted to drop her off a little rush kit made her this got her some little goodies i'm gonna drop that off at her house last night i ordered a bunch of clothes and purses and sunglasses and stuff off of shein they have some really cute stuff if you guys want to see a video of me like unboxing all my new cheap clothes let me know i'm so excited because i really want to start taking like better pictures and stuff for instagram and just like up my fits because I literally wear sweatpants every day. I just got these really cute new sweatpants. They look like this. Someone made fun of them at work today and I was like, mm, these are actually brand new. They're from Lonely Ghost. Speaking of work, I'm the only one there today and it is kind of lonely. I have one more hour left. Speaking of, I have to drive back there. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so I'm leaving work right now. My hair is so greasy. I haven't washed it in a couple days. So. Oh yay, my camera stayed. I use this scotch tape if anyone's wondering. It's like photo mounting tape. Oh shit. All right, resume. I literally don't know how to drive. Like I don't know right of way or anything like that. Oh my God, my hair looks so good. But I just send it. Okay, I just texted Sophia to meet me outside in like 30-ish minutes. You know, it's kind of, it's sad because usually for rush you're like at college and super fun, but with COVID it's freaking online and that's so sad. So I wanted to make it a little bit more special for her. Oh no. I almost got off on the wrong exit. I just don't know how to drive that well. I'm a good driver, but like sometimes my mind is just like, escapes me. I accidentally went viral on TikTok for showing my messy room, which is so embarrassing. What was my point? I don't know. See, I can't think and drive at the same time. Go! Oh, what is your problem? I don't have road rage, I just have road attitude. Everything's so tight. There's all these curbside pickup spots now and no regular spots. All right, I'll be back. All right, I'm back. I got some goodies. I got this like collapsible bin and I actually got two of them for five bucks. I also got her an everything will be okay candle. I feel like that's just such a good message. I got her, this is kind of stupid, but I got her this scented like unicorn thing. I just thought it was cute. I got her some hand sanitizer, candy, chocolate, some makeup, and now it looks so cute. Gift giving is my um, love language. I love giving gifts to people. Even just like little things like this is so fun to do. So cute. All right, Sophia, here I come. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was like, it's windy. I don't know if this is gonna blow away. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, that didn't go as planned exactly. Actually, it was fine because she just went outside. I was like at her door and I was like, uh, are you home? And I was like texting her and calling her, it was so embarrassing. Now I'm just on my way to meet the puppies. Hi, Vader. Hi, baby. Oh, he's so little. Hi. Is that normal? <laughs> Mommy loves you. You're still my baby. Oh, he's so calm. Vader's freaking crazy. <laughs> he's so cute. Vader like seems so big next to him. It's crazy. Vader, are you a big boy? You're no more baby? This is Boba. Look how precious. Say hi. <laughs> so cute. Uh, hi. He's so soft. <gasps> oh, he's so cute. Uh, are you just a puppy? Are you so cute? Does 
see how small he is? He's so cute! <laughs> Watch football? Oh my gosh! Vader is so big. Like, I thought Vader was the smallest puppy ever. But Boba's so small too! He's a little crazy. He's still such a baby. They started fighting a little bit, so I just gave them these little treats. Put them separate beds. I think Vader is a little territorial of this guy. What the hell? Oh, you're being so good. Out now. I'm doing a, a vlog today, by the way. What's up, vlog? Just got my new dog today. Now we're eating in and out. It is now 2 a.m. <laughs> I am just going to take a bath, and as I'm running the bath, I'm going to do my skincare routine. <laughs> Tell me why watching 17 again made me cry. I bet a lot of you guys can relate to this. I cannot watch like high school musical or anything related to high school without crying. It makes me really emotional and like you always think of like your life and like you always think of high school. At least for me, I always thought of high school and like the end of high school. I will never ever ever be in high school again. And because of COVID, I will never have a prom. Like original graduation that I was supposed to have. I don't ever have grad night or to another like basketball game or football game. It is probably it's pathetic. I feel like I'm just gonna wake up like and be like, oh my god, I had the worst dream. We had like a terrible year, like I didn't get a finish out high school high school pre-pandemic obviously not online high school i can't imagine like my younger sister's going through her freshman year online like that is we will never get these years back you know like i feel like they were destroyed that's why this movie is making me cry because they're like a basketball game and like, like i'll never have like another high school crush like i don't know why that makes me so sad or like talk about boys in the cafe like that was literally like my favorite thing to do also i'm on my period so maybe that's why i'm crying about this but yeah this movie is so good by the way you guys need to watch it also i know why i never watched it is because i was seven when it came out and it's very pg-13 so i wasn't allowed to watch it i remember when i was younger i was like i don't know why people make pg-13 and r-rated movies because that just makes it so kids can't watch it and it's like duh but like i thought that was so rude <laughs> wow that was one of the best movies i've seen i don't know if it's because i'm super emotional right now but 10 out of 10 high school romance movies are just the best sorry it's like not focusing you guys can barely see me and i look really bad but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it a little bit entertaining i love you so much and i'll see you in my next video good night Bye. Bye. Bye.